Oh, I got it. No. Oh, dude, I just missed it. Yo, what is going on, guys? Fortunate here, bringing you guys a Call of Duty 4 glitch video. Today, we're going to be living up some old school spots that you can do in old school free for all where you can jump higher and you get double the health. So, we're on backlot here on Call of Duty 4. First glitch that I can remember is right here on this dumpster, you do a strafe jump. You hit a nice strafe jump and you're completely out of the map just like that. It's literally crazy that they didn't even make a barrier on the outside of the map where you can literally just jump over. That's also why this game was so iconic and so fun. So realistically I could keep running around the entire map but I'm gonna show you guys more spots instead. Right up here and all I think you have to do now is prone backwards. Prone backwards or something like that. And merge your way through this little crack. Once you get around here, you gotta do a little scoot one more time. And then you get on top of this building completely, which is dope. Literally, there was so many glitches in this map, it was amazing. This map, this game, like imagine just seeing someone on the top of this huge building. I think you could run and jump over here, yep. It's crazy because legit any building you can run and jump on top. You can legit jump on top of any building and be on top of the map. Like, who the hell is going to expect this? Even jump over here. A little secret room. It's just pretty epic, man. Jump in this little corridor. There might be a couple more spots that I'm missing on this map, but uh, for the most part, I think I covered the main three slash two. So we're going to hop on board with a different map. I think my favorite and absolute most fun glitch spot was definitely Crossfire. There was just so many different glitches on this map. I mean, I know there's a spot over there, but I don't really remember how to do that one. We're going to go back to the straight OG type spot. Now this one you could be done in two ways. Uh, one of them was you jump on top of the washer and you kind of just... Kind of just jump and spam A right here and you get up and you just keep climbing, whatever. But I think this way may be easier right over in this corner. You kind of just jump on top of this and then... Kind of just jump on top of this and then you just a little jump to the right and you get up here. After the rock. Bang, bang. At this point, you're literally completely on top of the map. And this is the most, like, ridiculous part. You could follow around the map barriers. It's at this point you could le legitimately get on top of almost any building in the game. You jump right here onto this corner. Jump up here. Jump all the way up here. The whole entire map can be seen basically just from this one little spot. You could get on top of there as well. You could get completely outside of the map. Or you can stick around the map barrier as well. Follow along the map barrier. Keep on carrying through. And you're already on this side of the map, bro. Like, you could legitimately do anything. This is why COD 4 was so great, bro. They had a game mode specifically designed for glitches. Well, I just fell off. But yeah, for the most part, bro, it's just like there's so many different spots you can get into just off one glitch alone. And I know there's a spot over here to get on top of the building and whatnot, but uh, I don't remember how to do that one. So we're going to hop aboard with the next glitch. So now we are we are on block from COD 4 again, and I'm pretty sure most of you guys remember these glitches, but you do a run, jump, crouch. But right here, you can come up and you do a strafe, jump, crouch. And you hop over the fence and you literally just climb up the entire thing. Still going. Still going. Eventually you make it to the top and you want to do a nice jump over to here. Literally crazy because none of this is rendered at all. And at this point you can make a nice strafe jump to here. I think this is kind of difficult though. Oh, we did get it. We did get it. So now you could be on top of the map. Like literally this is crazy. Because you used to be able to do this all in a public match, which was old school free-for-all, I'm pretty sure. 
And imagine just seeing someone literally on top of the map up here. Like, what the hell can you do? Yeah, on top of the building, basically. Just sh shoot in and kill anyone. <laughs> Same thing works back here. Jump right over the freaking thing. Climb to the top. This one's not as high. There's also the little secret room back over here. Not really very much of a glitch, but... but also jump over this one. Should be almost at the top, and we're at the top. Now, in COD 4 Remastered, it's messed up because literally all of these are blocked off. Like, why, why would they do that? Land on this little ledge here. Just, just imagine just shooting people from all the way on top of the map. What, what are they going to do? They just, like, they got to suffer. Alright, that should about do it for block. Like I said, if I'm missing any, go ahead and shoot them down in the comments below. I'm just doing these based off memory. Yes, I got it! Wow! That is the most fun but annoying thing to try and do. It literally took me at least 20 minutes to finally land that. This is one of the best spots on freaking Pipeline because it's so hard to do. You never really see anyone up here ever. I always thought it was an RPG like uh, bounce, but I don't think so. Did it without one, so. And I sort of fell down in the house, but I know you could get all the way on top and to the other side and whatnot. I just wanted to hit that bounce once for the video. Um, I don't think I can get back up, though. I know you can get all the way to the other side and jump through these and whatnot, but uh, I completely fell off. So I don't, really don't feel like trying that bounce again. Also, if you didn't know, the little bounce off the truck. Cod 4 bounces were just so much fun. I know there's a couple other spots on this map, but uh, I really only wanted to do that big bounce glitch because that was my favorite. Alright, so we're on Vacant here, guys. Um, vacant, I'm pretty sure 90% of you guys who have played this game, Call of Duty 4, know this glitch. Jump on the fridge, jump crouch over here, follow your way, and jump up. And literally, it was that easy to get on top of the whole entire building. After I do this little jump crouch, here we go. Oh, this was the, my favorite because this one was so easy and you tend to get vacant a lot with uh, old school free for all and just running around on the roof killing everyone. So much fun. I'm not sure if you could... I know you could jump to a couple of spots. I think you might be able to jump on top of that. Let's see. Yeah, I don't exactly remember what things you could jump on, but legit, like, come on, this is stupid OP, getting up here in an actual game. Anyways, let's hop aboard with the next map. No Alright, on Downpour, I do know a couple of different spots, one being right here on the tractor. Little strafe jump. Well, oh, messed up my jump completely. Little strafe jump on the roof. Bang. This one also worked in uh, Modern Warfare Remastered. Fun spot. And you could also get on top of this part right here. So just do a quick run and jump crouch. Probably don't have to crouch, but yeah. Nice little six spot. Dope, dope, dope. The other spot I'm remembering is a bit difficult, but uh, I hope I can do it. Alright, so I sort of remember how to do this now. This one, not strictly from memory. I mean... A little bit remembered it, but I know you get on this ledge and you gotta make a strafe jump onto that little wire. Yes, I got it. Okay. So now you're on top of this building, but um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to hit this strafe jump onto the roof. I remember you can get up there and then like get on top of the map or whatever, but let's try it. Why not? I got it. Let's go. I legit remember this from so long ago, I can't believe I was able to do it. I'm pretty sure you can go on the map barrier. Somehow, like, run and jump onto it. There's gotta be a way. I don't know if it's from this side or this side. Uh, well, I butchered it. Well, anyway, you can get on top of the map barrier on one of the sides and then just follow it around. Because I remember that I used to be able to go inside a... 
I used to be able to land inside here somehow by following the map barrier, but I don't exactly remember how to do that. But anyways, let's move along with one final map. Alright, so on wet work, there are a classic couple of glitches that I remember. There are a couple decent spots I know on wet work. One of them happens to be right here. There we go. Little strafe jump crouch, and you get on top of this little pole. And then at this point, you can climb all the... Dream Ripper. Here we go. Got back up here. Can we not fall off this time? We'll slowly but surely make our way to the top. Why am I an idiot? Slowly but surely. And we made the top. Yeah. I knew you could get all the way up here, but I just, for some reason, kept falling off. Rip. I'm pretty sure you could strafe jump from there onto the outside uh, edge of the barrier and be floating in the air, basically. But hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. I know there's a ton more spots, but uh, I just wanted to show you guys some I remembered off the top of my head. If you guys got some you can remember off the top of your head, definitely leave them down in the comments if I missed them. If you did remember these and you did do them a lot when you were a kid, go ahead and drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you guys are brand new, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.